So first up we have the sunflowers here. These are the sunflower seedlings that I started from botanical interest seeds and I was originally growing them as a microgreen but I decided you know this is just like a test batch. So we are going to transplant these into just you know a regular good old fashioned eight tray kind of plant holder. So if you look here these are just piled two on top of each other and it kind of cover some of the holes but i think this works really good because it's kind of like doing soil blocking you're getting a little air pruning action you know this is definitely something that's going to make a little mess so if you're starting indoors maybe not the best but this is what we're going to do so here i have just the eight cell i filled it up with some pro mix here and we're just going to pop probably two a piece in here and then cover it up with some more dirt And this is my Promix station here. Just hack some of this off. So this essentially is the consistency here of the Promix. I'm a big fan. I usually just cut open a big cardboard box like this, work inside of here. That way, eventually, this just kind of turns into its own little planting tray. But it is the homestead version, if you will. And there you have it. So now we've got our sunflower seedlings in, we've got our spinach, our radishes, and last transplant for today is a little bit of a different kind. This is actually one of my indoor plants. That is this beautiful money tree that I have here. And this guy is just dying for a bigger pot. So one of the things with these is you don't want to use too big of a pot. You do want to keep them kind of in, in like a limited because they, they basically have a very succulent quality to them. So I am essentially just going to use this pot here, which is, I mean, essentially this one just fits in there. And that is how I like to size up anything like this that has more of that succulent habit. Basically, it'll suck up as much water as it can get its hands on and essentially it'll just drown itself. So I think this is a really good tip and technique is that if the pot just fits in this one, then it is a good size. So... I also think, look at this, like it just, it, it's coming right out of this. I think I might, now I'm going to put a layer. I'm going to put a little bit of a layer of dirt in there first. Okay. And now, you can see the roots here. We're definitely getting a little root bound. So, I'm just going to loosen just... You know, you don't really want to rip or tear much, but you just, it's okay if you do, you know, break a couple off. But we just kind of want to loosen them and let them know that they have other options now. So, okay, and then I'm just going to fill this in with the rest of this dirt. All right, and there we have it. Money tree is replanted. 
spinach, broccoli. All right, our work is done for today.